hello hope you are fine i am fine it's a couple of days before christmas eve um, that is the day we celebrate most here in sweden and i'm filming it a few days early so yeah it's fine we're not gonna be in here in our home on christmas eve so it's it's a bit easier of course uh, so this will go up on on boxing day is that the word uh two days after christmas eve so hope you have a lovely holiday and uh, christmas and new year and everything if you celebrate that and this is uh women who rock rock pan uh, women who rock um and it's created by cc kim and ruth and it's a year-long project started on Women's Equality Day, the 26th of August. So this will be the fourth update. Uh, <laughs> and I have, what do I have? I have two uh, rollouts today. So I'm going to show you them first. And um, yeah, for Krista McAuliffe, uh, a rising star, a product that rose to the occasion. I picked the RFSU, it's a Swedish name, in team cooling balm after shaving reduces red spots. It took me a while to um, learn to use this, but now I like it and it's, I have already bought another tube of this and it's, it's good, but it's done. And I used up four grams since the last update and it has gone down uh, 13 grams since the intro it wasn't full I had it in another project before so this is done the other product uh, that I have done is for Jane Goodall and that is a cruelty free product and I picked the color correction uh, shade the yellow shade from the Catrice color correction palette I had it in this little jar uh, and it's gone and I'm so glad I used it as an under eye corrector and it wasn't the right shade but it worked but the consistency was a bit too thick and uh, hard to blend and um, it was easier when I used a more liquidy uh, concealer on top but I used like, a, like the same consistency of a concealer first and that was not a good match so i'm glad to have this done and that means i have the whole palette done i have it done but i can show you. i can reach it this whole thing is actually done and i'm so glad uh, and when i finished it i noticed that the only color correct corrector i need is for under eyes and that is a peach shade i could use a green sometimes but i don't need five different shades so that's gone I'm not going to buy a big palette anytime <laughs> more, anymore because that wasn't what I needed. So back to the list and the progress I have on other things. For Beyonce, Run, to, Run the World Girls, a product from a female-owned brand. I picked Huda Beauty and the Tan Tour Contour Bronzer and Cream in Fair. And it was very dirty like this. I like this a lot. It's a very nice cream bronzer, I think. And I use a um, duo, duo, duo fiber brush. So it's kind of disturbed <laughs> in the jar. But I like it a lot. I have used this 17 times since the last update and 51 times in total. And it has gone down 0.2 three grams since the last update so you need very a very small amount to use it and my goal for that one is to hit pan i think i don't remember helen ready i am a woman hear me roar a product that gives you confidence and i picked the ccs footwatch salva also a swedish brand and it's dirty because i often use i have <laughs> when i use this i have like gradual tan on my hands and it's kind of <laughs> goes on to this poor thing uh, this is a big tube of foot cream and uh, i have used um, 
25 grams since the last update. I don't count uses on this one, but I use it every time I take a shower. So that's that. Then we have for Rachel Platten, the fight song, fight song, a product that you have to fight to use up. And I picked the Anastasia eye primer. It's kind of tricky to use this, but I have learned how to use it. Um, but I have another eye primer that I use when I'm going out or something. It's so much easier. This is, man, it's a switch for, uh, it's getting very light. So hopefully I can uh, use it up pretty soon in a few months, maybe. I don't know. I have used it 16 times since the last update in total 71 times and it has lost 0.5 grams since the last update. I think I use more than when I use something else because if you use too little it gets patchy so you have to put on pretty much and then dab it away with a little sponge or something. At least I do it like that. Then for Rosa Parks, stand-up product, and I picked my beloved Filorga Time Flash Base Active, I always read the French, uh, Express Smoothing Active Primer. Uh, I'm not concentrating on this one because it's so good. I have another primer that I don't like as much in this project, but I have used it. Uh, three times so 23 in total and it has lost only oh no a gram of use so I'm not sure where I am there somewhere I don't know but it will go when it goes I savor it a bit because I love it so much uh, for Princess Diana something tough but beautiful I picked the Catrice Stylo eyeshadow pen brown to earth and I have used a lot of it. I'm so glad. <laughs> you can see the jump here. Uh, I use it under my eye, bottom eyelashes and top it with an eyeshadow. And I use it as a base for eyeshadows on the lid. So it goes a lot faster than the other one of these I used before. Uh, hopefully I can get as much use next month. I really hope so because I... In the summer, I'm not going to use this. I know that. I don't wear my makeup as much in the summer either. So hopefully I can use it uh, up in June at least uh, before my vacation. Um, so I really hope so. We will see. Uh, this has gone down 0.2 grams and I used it 17 times. So that's that we have uh, Anne Frank uh, something that makes you feel brave I put put in the powder from physicians formula the youthful wear translucent illuminating blah, blah, blah. Uh, it has have pan for a long time in another project I use it on my cheek area and I don't need much. I have used up 0.3 grams. I used it 18 times and total in total 74 times. So this will stay here for a long time. It's fine, but I can't use it all over my face. I can, but I won't. <laughs> Martina McBride, the, this one for the girls, something that makes you feel beautiful. And I picked my favorite foundation that they don't make anymore. The Estee Lauder Double Wear Light Foundation SPF 10 in the shade 2N1 um, Desert Beige. I use it four times. I savor this too. These two are my perfect, <laughs> perfect. Um, base products so four times in total 23 it has gone down 0.2 grams no sorry two grams uh, so but this is feels lighter than this one but not much <laughs> I don't want them to go this one still exists so that's good but the foundation is my favorite <sighs> then for Katy Perry, Roar, a product that makes you feel fierce. I picked the Bondi Sands Glow. I haven't used it since August, September, October. I don't remember, but I haven't used it. 
Sakagawea, a product that helps out your skin or makeup look. And I picked the Rituals SPF 30 for the body. I haven't used it either. And then we have for Frida Kahlo, a pop culture product. And I picked the MAC Fix Plus uh, in rose. This has gone down 12 grams, this. And I didn't mark it. Uh, I can, but it's not like accurate because I have it in this little bottle too. So I will probably pour it into this one or I don't know. But I'm going to travel a few days now, so I will bring this one. But maybe I will pour it back again then when I'm back again. So I have used it 18 times in total 58. Love it. Three more, four more. Julia Child, a food themed item. And here is the other primer I talked about. Uh, the last three days I think I have mixed it with the foundation that I don't like and because it's peeled up on me and it was so annoying uh, so I mixed it with the foundation and it worked better so I have used more than I had before I have used it 15 times in total 24 times this is not a big tube it's 20 milliliters so I really hope to have this finished before spring like in March or so, uh, because it's glowy. And I don't need that. Um, it has gone down six and a half grams. Serena Williams, um, something, a product that you used to hate, but learned to love. And I have loved this from the beginning, but I didn't love lip scrubs in the beginning because I tried a bad one so but this is good good it's the Barry M pineapple lip scrub and it smells amazing and I have used a bit here I don't count the uses on this one but I have used up almost well one and a half grams of that one and Marie Curie uh, a product that you have newly discovered um, and I picked the Excellent Lashes Foam Cleanser with Aloe Vera, this one, which I really don't like. And I think I can see through it, but I didn't prepare. So I am down here somewhere. I bought it because it's good for my lash extensions. And that's why I don't have any makeup on my eyes, <laughs> because I'm going to do my lashes today. And but I don't like the scent, I don't like the consistency, I don't like anything about this, but I'm using it up. And I have used up 11 grams since the last update. I will probably use it all over my face when another thing is done, so I just get rid of it. And the last one is for Ruth Bader Ginsburg. Uh, use the nine pan palette nine times, and I've picked the Star Wars Mandalorian palette from Color Pop. I have only used it once since, so in total four, yes, four times. So five more to go. I am very focused on another palette right now. So this will just have like one or two uses per update, I think. But that's it. That's everything. Hope you enjoyed. Please subscribe if you like this and uh, please comment down below. It is always nice to talk to you. And have a nice uh, holiday if you have a holiday. Bye-bye.